We are going to make this decision now. The Fox News decision desk has called Pennsylvania for Donald Trump. This means that Donald Trump will be the 45th president of the United States, winning the most unreal, surreal <laughs> election we have ever seen. The revolution has begun. In a lot it's of over. States. If she hasn't won Pennsylvania by now, she's not coming back. No, that's bullshit. I won't believe anything until I hear Rachel Maddow say it. She's the only one I trust. How is this happening? It's a politics of fear. It always works. What started off as unlikely, impossible, is now reality. He said he was always a winner. This did not come without controversy. Fuck you, world! Entrepreneur. You and say! You have now confirmed that Secretary Clinton has conceded to Donald Trump. Uh, this concession took place in a phone call. It is my high honor to introduce to you the president elect of the United States of America, Donald Trump. Our own state of Michigan. She's losing by 10,000 votes. That's the size of this town. And who's at 40,000 votes and counting? Jill Stein. Is that true? Path to victory that was unlike anything we've ever seen. It did not come without controversy. It did not come without splitting this country in some of the most divisive language. It does come now at a time where his supporters say this is the evidence. I hope every one of those voters who decided it was a good time to cast a protest vote is happy when that psycho gets us all killed. Honey, don't get so worked up. <sighs> Shut up, Marilyn. I told you to go vote, but you didn't listen. Now look what happened. Look at our friends on the couch and tell them that they might not be able to maintain their rights as a married couple because you were too busy today on Etsy to go vote! I don't want you to not be marrying her. Oh, sweetheart. Sweetheart, come here. Listen to me. You don't have to worry about that. That is never going to happen. OK. Oz, you don't have to worry, because nothing is going to happen to us. OK? Donald J. Trump. 